I mean, the best digital audio workstation is the one you know how to use. Basically, even if we give you like, I'm, I think like producers from way back in the day, they used they used to like jam out on MPCs. Those MPCs were limited as shit. Like they had so many limitations, but because they knew how to work within those limitations, they were able to produce the most out of those. So like, if you are an expert producer, and we just give you like a totally different door, a different workflow. Surely, like you'll be you'll be crippled in your work because your production will actually like slow down. You won't move at the pace at which you usually move at because you know the shortcuts to the door that you usually do use. So that's the one thing that you understand. The best workstation will always be the one that you know where everything is. Like we, the one you that you you are most comfortable with, the one that you know where the work, where everything is, and that will make make things to it will make to make the translation easier from the ideas from like to make the translation of ideas from your brain to music quite easy and quick. Yeah, it almost becomes like an extension of your arm because you're just clicking, you're clicking on shortcuts and like figuring out where things are can get in the way of your creativity. Did you get that? So focus on one door, that's what I would expect, uh, that's what I would advise and then diversify from there, like maybe just get a few plugins, just focus on the essentials, not really the luxuries, but the essentials of what you just need. And Avoid over purchasing everything. Because YouTube, uh, avoid over purchasing everything. YouTube is one place where like, if you go on YouTube, everybody's trying to see you something. Like, this is a new 8 or 8 thing that you need. This is a th thing that you've always needed to make great music. But the truth is, it's not really about that. Come on. Like, most of these high end productions have like, heard some of the produ biggest producers in the game. And when you listen to their uh, beats, just like something simple, like just a dark melody playing. Uh, just a few high hats and just just this weekend snare and this hard hit snare just some it's never really that crazy unless if you make orchestra or something like that but or a e d m a but even then the arrangement is always simple just so it's never really that crazy but the misconception is you need to have some of the most complex music artists uh, configurations to make the best music no 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 simplicity is key.